This recording will have a short conversation followed by a question. Listen carefully and pick the best answer based on what you hear. You should be particularly careful of idioms. Number 1 I can't believe you almost missed your flight. How did you make it on time? It was crazy. Traffic was a nightmare, and I got to the airport with only minutes to spare. I boarded the plane by the skin of my teeth. What does the man imply about catching his flight? Number 2. My car broke down on the way to work, and now I'm late for a big meeting. Oh no, that's awful. To add insult to injury, did you find parking easily when you finally got here? What does the woman imply about the man's situation? Number 3. I spent all afternoon cleaning the kitchen, and then the kids spilled juice all over the floor. Ugh, that's frustrating. Looks like we're back to square one. What does the man imply about the situation? Number 4. I studied for hours for this test, but I still feel unprepared. Don't worry, just wing it. You're a smart cookie and you'll figure it out. What does the woman imply about the test? Number 5. I can't believe it rained all weekend. Our camping trip is ruined. Don't sweat it. Maybe we can reschedule for next weekend and hope for better weather. What does the man suggest? Number 6. I almost aced that history test. I missed just one question. That's still pretty impressive. But remember, close, but no cigar. What does the woman mean by close, but no cigar? Number 7. I can't wait to go on vacation. I already bought all my new outfits. Don't count your chickens before they hatch. What if something happens and you can't go? What warning does the man give the woman?
Number 8. I volunteered at the animal shelter all weekend. It was a lot of work, but it felt good to help. That's awesome. Even though it might seem like a drop in the bucket, every little bit helps those animals. What does the man imply about the woman's volunteering? Number 9. I can't believe I broke the vase. How am I going to explain this to mom? You'll have to face the music eventually. Just be honest and take responsibility. What does the woman mean by face the music? Number 10. So, how did you like the new sushi restaurant downtown? It wasn't bad, but sushi isn't really my cup of tea. I prefer Italian food. What does the woman imply about sushi? Number 11. I know we need to have this difficult conversation, but I'm dreading it. I understand. Maybe it's best to just rip off the band-aid and get it over with. What does the man suggest? Number 12. Hey, would you like to come to the movies with me tonight? Sounds fun, but I'm swamped with work right now. Maybe we can take a rain check on that and go another time? What does the man politely ask for? Number 13. I don't think I can finish this project by myself. It's a two-person job. Don't throw in the towel yet. Maybe we can brainstorm some ideas together and see if we can come up with a solution. What does the woman suggest? Number 14. You know, I think I finally figured out why the car is making that rattling noise. Really? Let me hear your theory. You might have just hit the nail on the head. What does the man imply about the woman's idea?
Number 15. Hey, I was wondering, are you planning anything special for your birthday this year? Maybe, but don't spill the beans yet. It's a surprise. What does the woman want the man to do?